Hey, how's it going? Uh, today we're gonna draw an Among Us character with an egg hat. Uh, it's gonna be real simple, really easy. I'm gonna be using this, a Faber-Castell PATT artist pen. Uh, it's big brush, it's basically a marker. You can use any marker you want. And I think in this one you might be able to use a pen as well. Uh, but yeah, so join in, it's gonna be step by step. Like I said, if you're a beginner, this is perfect. Uh, let's get going. Oh, paper-wise, I'm using uh, regular printing paper. So it's, it's good for practice and it's extremely inexpensive. So that's the good part. So let's get started. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start with that egg hat. I'm gonna start with a slight turn here for one of the egg drippings. Slight turn here front of that egg dripping and then kind of the yolk of that egg right with a sunny side up since we're not going to be doing color i'm going to uh, instead of uh, that would normally be a color right there change but what i'm going to do is i'm going to draw a thin line so i'm going to ease the pressure on whatever pen or pencil i'm using pen a uh, marker and i'm going to do that that's probably the only time we're really going to need that so we got that hat Let's pull forward to the front of the face. I'm gonna start the visor on the front of the face. So I'm gonna pull down here, pull across the top. Pull over. Pull underneath. And now we have kind of that round kind of, uh, I guess, visor you call it, the thing, the window you see outside of that spacesuit. <clears throat> Don't forget to subscribe. Every time you subscribe, it does help the channel out as far as like the algorithm goes. It just recommends us to other people. And just in general, it's free. And uh, like I said, I post three times every single weekday. So I'm posting 15 simple, simple drawing tutorials every day. Uh, so when you subscribe, it's probably gonna tell you about 25% of those in all honesty. It's not gonna tell you all of them, I'm sure. Um, but it will give you a notification every now and then that I've posted something. Uh, so if you do find my stuff worth your time, uh, please consider subscribing, it helps. Uh, the algorithm shows that 90% of people are not subscribed. They just kind of check it out, hang out, and then watch stuff. And that's for the most part, they haven't subscribed. I see a lot of repeat people here that haven't subscribed either. That's interesting in the comments. Um, but definitely subscribe now. It'll help us out. Uh, thank you. If, if you can. Uh, pull over here. So now I'm going to pull down from the back. That's essentially just going to be the back side of them, you know? These characters are cool, by the way. I like their design. Their design's very, uh, you can make toys out of them easily, right? They're very, like, marketable, cool designs of the, in the Among Us world here. Uh, well, not really world. I mean, it is kind of a mini game, right? But it's 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 very, very cool designs to these characters. Um, they're kind of kind of cute. I don't know if you consider them cute. They are kind of cute. Let's pull the, the front side here. Uh, if you do want to learn to draw cute stuff, I have an ebook in the description, so don't forget to check that out. It goes over the proportions of cuteness, uh, and you should be able to have you should have a really really good idea of cute after you read that. Um, th that is a really short ebook, and it's in the description, totally totally free. So it's somewhere in the description. I don't know where I put it in the description. It's not at the top, but somewhere in there. All right, let's pull over here to the bottom foot, and go down. And let's pull here in this foot. up in up over here now you have that bottom foot there and let's give him that backpack so around the bottom of his body here uh, I'm gonna mark it then around mid visor I'm gonna mark it over here I'm gonna pull that out and it's almost like a loaf of bread on his back I, I i think of like things in abstract shapes to make them easier for you to identify so i mean really that's a space backpack but i, I look at it as like a loaf of bread <laughs> and then i'm gonna pull a line like just to show some visor window thing and pull a line here in 
So now let me do this next part. The next part is I'm gonna thicken the line everywhere. My, my marker isn't really that thick right now. So I'm gonna thicken the line everywhere to make it look more like the uh, animation in the, in the actual game. So I'm gonna thicken it maybe twice as much. Um, and I recommend you do the same if you haven't. Um, so while that's going on, let me talk to you a little bit about random stuff. Um, as far as the channel goes, uh, I am amazed and proud that I'm doing this channel uh, with all you guys. It's been like one of the, literally the, and I know I'm exaggerating maybe, but maybe not. I don't feel like, I feel like this is the most rewarding thing I have ever done artistically. Um, just kind of talking to people on here. It's like so immensely fun to talk to new people in the comments and just, uh, you know, just kind of, I don't know, just, just having that effect, even though I'm not changing the world per se, uh, you know, like people do say, Hey, you know, cool. This helped me out. Or I'm drawing this for class or that stuff really, really helps my soul. Let's say, I don't know what to call it, but it really helps me out a lot. And because of that, that's why I've been posting like three times every single weekday. And I think I'm going to up it to every single day pretty soon. Um, cause I'm finding it to be, you know, so like easy and enjoyable to do that. I mean, it's definitely hard on me. Don't get me wrong. It takes time to edit. Um, but in general, it's, it's a lot of this is rewarding. The actual drawing part right here, this is rewarding. The part that's not is the editing. Maybe I can outsource it one day if like the channel makes enough money where I can just kind of like literally outsource all the editing. So all I have to do is just draw and hang out. Um, the editing is the part I'm not big on, but uh, yeah, overall, it's just been an amazing uh, journey and I'm really uh, humbled and really happy about it. Other than that, as far as general drawing goals, I'm working on a book right now with a friend who's writing it. It's a book about dragons, uh, dragon, uh, and I'm ha having to, uh, do some stuff for that and help her out. Uh, that's kind of what I'm working on as far as like work, like commission work. Okay, so watch the marker, by the way. Even this is a good, I talk about control a lot, like controlling your marker, controlling your line quality. This is a great exercise as well, would be tracing your own picture, like thickening it out because you have to pay attention to kind of how you're doing that and it, it allows you to have a, a it, it, it kind of adds to your level of control to the entire thing. So I have to fix some lines here. See right there, squiggly. And I, and I fix it as much as I can. It doesn't have to be perfect. Don't worry about it. But I'm fixing it as much as I can. And, and that's kind of like a good exercise in itself because you're fixing these edges. You're learning to spot mistakes and trying to fix them. Um, but anyways, I hope you had a great time. Uh, like I said, let me know uh, stuff in the comments. Share the video if you did enjoy it. That helps the channel out tremendously. Uh, and it also just kind of brings in a like really, really cool energy when people do that. Um, and thank you so much. I will talk to you in the next video. This has been Easy Pictures to Draw, and I will see you next time.